Oh, strawberry cream cheese croissant. Yum. Imagine this on the streets, eh, Sunua? Get out of my way! Hi, everyone, and welcome back to Bali Life with Richard, and welcome to our beautiful Sunua. So, today we're going to answer the million dollar question which one is better, the Icon Mall or Living World? Let's go check it out. Alright, so that's the first time in our own that we've actually left the Nui area. We've been riding around with friends up at Ubud and stuff, but through Tempasar, through Renon, all that kind of stuff, full of traffic, there was a few moments there that were a bit hairy, but we got through it. But we're here now, and behind us is Living World, so we're going to go inside, have a look, and we'll determine whether Living World is better than the new Icon Mall. Come inside and let's have a look. Okay, so we've come in for the area. Oh, very nice inside. Look at that. Wow. I'm not quite sure if this is what level it is, but it uh, looks like it's a food court. And it's lower ground. Check this out for homewares and stuff. That looks pretty trendy. So that is called Pendopa. Wow. Look at that. Hello. Very nice. Chicken bowls. Oh yeah, you get the old chicken bowls. You know, you get these chicken bowls here. Looks like you got heaps from here. Look at that. Lovely homeware. They've got a lot of shirts here as well too. Oh, they've got really nice shirts. Probably a bit thick. They're long sleeves. Women's clothes as well too. Seventy nine dollars. Bit exy. <laughs> very, very nice. A lovely store. So this is the first store that we came into once we parked the bike. But I've got to tell you, very impressive. Very impressive. So they've got the gelato factory here, which is the same as down in Forquet on uh, Jalan Tamblingan. All your stuff there, same prices, which is really good. We quite often just walk past and get a cane or so when we're walking down Tambling Ann. Oh, look at them, don't they look good? Yum. Anyone for a donut? Yeah. Look at that. Wow. Yummy, 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 yummy donuts. Oh, strawberry cream cheese croissant. Yum. Oh, they're brownies, different flavour brownies. Yummy. Red Velvet Classic, yum. We've got like a little Yamaha stand down here for your different Yamaha bikes. Got the Fazio like we have, Falano. Then up to the bigger bikes. Oh, I've got the NMAX. Very nice. Jewelry shopping, can't enough jewelry. That's what Karen says anyway.
outside here you've got this beautiful area surrounded by trees and nature. So this is down on the bottom level there where the food court is. You come out here and you get something to eat. You can see out here it's got some lovely background music. Ah, got a Volkswagen out there as well too. It goes all the way down. Check that out. Wow. Hello. Hello. Can I order two strawberry crunchy? Strawberry not crunchy. No, oh, strawberry's not crunchy? Yeah. Okay, which one's crunchy? What is uh, chocolate? chocolate? Crunchy, Do you want cheese, chocolate? Caramel. No? Have, um, hazelnut. Okay, one hazelnut and one chocolate crunchy, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you, Makasi. All right, check that out. How good does that look? This is the chocolate one. Karen had the hazelnut, and Karen's saying the hazelnut's really, really good. So we'll put on these by friends of ours, Janine and Neil. They said, you've got to go and try these out. So this is you guys, so let's have a look. Wow, you guys aren't wrong. They are bloody lovely. And look at all the chocolate. I can't tilt it too much because all the chocolate's going to pour out of it. But check all that out. Look at that inside. Just oozes of it. Thanks, guys. Thanks for the recommendation. Okay, so we've finished down on the bottom floor. So the bottom floor was the food stuff. Heaps and heaps of food, eateries there, fantastic, heaps of options. So we're on the second floor now where all the stores are. So it looks like there's four floors in total. So we're going to go through and show you. Now all the stores don't have closed areas. They're all open to the public. So you can sort of just walk through them. And the good thing is when you walk through them, the uh, staff are not all over you. It's pretty good. Now we'll just video the area and just show you guys, but interesting. One thing I will say, the icon is nicer looking inside in regards to the architecture and being on the waterfront. Here it's a bit more like a mall in Australia. Anyway, we'll show you the different shops they've got here. So this is how they're, they're made. They're all open, so you can actually walk through. This one's empty, obviously you're gonna get done, but you can actually walk through and you're not all enclosed. So it's all open. I reckon it's a great idea. They should look at something like this in Australia because I reckon it's bloody awesome. Check this out. <laughs> <Woo -hoo. laughs> Imagine this on the streets, eh, Sunua? Get out of my way! <laughs> so we're down in Informa, so this is one of the shops that the icon doesn't have. 
So it's all furniture in here. Now this also runs into Ace hardware. So side by side, we'll take you through Ace anyway and show you a few things. But as you can see on the other side, just over there, is all your Ace hardware. So if you're looking for a couch or a land suite or a uh, dining table and even some uh, knickknacks to put around your villa or your apartment, you can pop down here. They've got pictures and all that kind of stuff too. Come down and have a bit of a look. I've lost her. I don't know where she is. <laughs> I'm just walking around aimlessly. I think she's on a mission. I'll eventually find her. If not, please call the police. All right, so we're now in Ace. As I said, Ace is part of Informa. Well, actually runs into Informa. They've got safes, they've got everything here. We're just going to walk through and just show you some bits and pieces. Massive store, this one. If you're looking for all your cameras for your accommodation, where you're staying, etc., there. And look, here we are. Wave the camera. <laughs> Tim the tool man. There we go. This is what you want. Got compressors on the other side as well too. And we drill bits, etc. Being a fairly big hardware, they've got a lot of stuff here. This is the blokey area. I see her, she's down there. Come back. Come back. Nope, she's gone. So that concludes our Living World Tour. What do you think? Well, my opinion is, I think it's actually nicer inside for shops, etc., than the uh, Bali Icon. But the Bali Icon is nice inside with the architecture and things like that. Now, one question Karen asked, which I'd like you guys, if you know the answer, put in the comments below. When you buy clothes here, where are the change rooms? I don't know because we looked in those little stores that are in the center that are all open. There's no change rooms there. If you know, let us know in the comments. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, guys, hit that like and subscribe. Remember the thumbs up, that's uh, really important. If you can do that for us, we'll appreciate it. But also share it to your family and friends, please. The other thing too is remember our uh, Facebook page, Bali Life with Richard and Karen. Pop on by and join the community there. But thank you all for watching. We'll see you all in the next video. And if you watch this video here, that's one of our latest ones that we have done. Hope you'll have a lovely day. Okay, bye.